Today, many gathered at the Nelson Atkins Museum to say goodbye to a Kansas City legend, Henry Block. Block passed away last week at the age of 96. 41 Action News reporter Tom Dempsey is at the museum right now. And Tom, what can you tell us about the public <clears throat> memorial today? Well, Krista, Henry Block impacted many lives throughout his lifetime, and that was really on full display today here at the Nelson Atkins Museum with even an overflow room set up for this memorial service today. Many people talking about how Block impacted their lives, and today he was remembered not only as a business innovator and a World War II veteran who served over in Europe during World War II, but also as a man who selflessly gave back to, you know, the arts community and the education community right Right here in the metro. Again, many people gathered inside the Nelson Atkins Museum for this event today. His family describing Block as a man who came from modest means, who later, of course, co founded HR Block and became a business titan. His children and grandchildren describing him as being soft spoken and good humored while also wanting to help many others. Of course, local figures too are at this service today, including Mayor Sly James. Everyone there today saying he leaves behind a legacy of giving back to the city he loved. I will forever be humbled by what he accomplished, for what he stood for, and how he lived his life. Dad always said, Kansas City has been good to me. I owe a debt to the city that I can never repay. You're not always going to see the legacy. Sometimes it's going to be lived. His legacy is going to live on in some of the people that he helped. Around a thousand people attended the memorial service today. And keep in mind, too, there's also a live stream event at the downtown H&R Block corporate head headquarters. Many people coming together today, Krista, to honor Henry Block. Live outside the Nelson Atkins Museum, I'm Tom Dempsey, 41 Action News.